Banu says, is there any significance in people claiming that they found Allah's name written on a bread that they baked in, uh, or on an apple or a vegetable or see it on any structure like a rock or a fish, etc.? How do we explain to such people about it? First of all, there is no significance, none whatsoever, of this at all. This is a test from Allah Azza wa Jal. And it also can be part of the whispers of shaitan. Now, people say, this is a miracle. A child was born with the name of Allah Azza wa on his arm. I opened or split an apple into two halves, and in one of the half, I found Muhammad Rasulullah. A photographer took a, a, a photo of an orchard or a garden, and the trees, you can see clearly, La ilaha illallah. So this is a sign. Muslims don't need this. It was never displayed at the time of the Prophet ﷺ, where he went and said, look guys, it's written Allah, or it's written Muhammad, or whatever, because it has no significance. What has importance in our lives is the Quran, is the Sunnah. And that is it. Imagine to those who claim that this has significance and importance and that it, this is a miracle. Imagine if a Christian opened a watermelon and it was engraved in it, Jesus, the Son of God. What will you say then? Oh, this is from Shaitan. Why is this from Shaitan and this is from Ar-Rahman? You can't cherry pick like this. So we say the same thing. This has no significance. It's from shaitan. He's messing up with you. Likewise here, it's from shaitan. He's messing up with you. If you see a rock with a rock formation or even a mountain and you see that it, there is the name of Allah engraved on it or in a way the wind made it look like this, this has no significance in Islam at all. As Muslims, as believers, we don't pay any attention to that. And I would advise you to do the same.